Sharma climbing, Gava. We're just about 15 minutes from the center of Barcelona. And with a space like this, I felt like pretty much had the opportunity to let my imagination run wild and do something a little bit over the top. The key elements of the design in all of our gyms is creating these social spaces. Of course, with Sharma Climbing Gava, we had this amazing opportunity to create kind of my dream gym. You know, we had so much space to work with. Oftentimes, our tendency is to want to just fill it with as much climbing terrain as possible, but you have to think about what that space is going to be like when you put 500 people in there. We really kind of put a lot of focus on creating those social zones and walkways. And so I'm really proud with this gym. You know, we have try, tried to make a really wide variety of angles. Of course, we wanted to have a really big, impressive lead wall where we can hold, you know, big competitions and events, all with a direct line of visibility. and then create you know, designated areas for top roping, for lead climbing. Of course, we have this amazing mezzanine for auto belays, which we really designed intentionally to create a space solely dedicated for the auto belays, just to kind of keep them all in one place. It's a, it's a great way to kind of be able to monitor that zone. Trauma Climbing Gava really represents kind of the cutting edge of climbing gym design, climbing gym spaces, you know, well lit, climatized. Um, we've got amazing, unique concept for our bouldering area. For Sharma Climbing, it was really important to create a space that had terrain for all abilities. You know, whether it's the very first time beginner or the you know, total expert, sometimes it's, it's a challenge to, to find that that balance, but it's really important to kind of create that terrain for everyone.